BCTV 2.0. We are your BCTV anchors for today. Hi, I'm Jaylene. And I'm Faith. And today is Thursday, September 29th. Now please stand for the flag salute. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The weather today is 90 degrees. Keep cool and drink lots of water, Bobcat. The weather in Zimbabwe, Africa is 86 degrees. Bobcats, please make sure to arrive on time to school every day. If you are late, please go to the attendance office with your parents. Have you turned in your handbook pages yet? Remember, they're towards the front of your agenda. They should be turned in to your fifth period teacher. The Instrumental Music Fall fundraiser is a letter writing campaign. So if you are in band or orchestra, please participate and help raise money for our school. Great job, everyone, for all your sales for our fundraiser. It was a huge success. Look like we, looks like we can pie face some teachers. Bingo night is coming up. It is on Friday, October 7th. Tickets go on sale every Friday, so make sure to get your tickets at the student store. They cost $35 per person and include a delicious buffet dinner, iced tea, coffee or water, dessert, and 12 bingo cards. Forms are in the office. Here's a video that one of our crews created about bingo night. Where did you get all of that blue stuff from? I went bingo night. Well, what did you do about bingo night? Well, LMS Bingo Night will be held on Friday, October 7th from 6 to 9 p.m. at the Yorba Linda Country Club. The tickets are being sold every Friday for $35 each in the student store. This payment includes the buffet dinner and dessert. You get 12 bingo cards and a dollar. If you play the game Heads or Tails, you could win cool prizes. I wish I went there too. Well, now you can. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Bingo to bingo. Bobcats, the PTSA Bingo Night is on Friday, October 7th. Make sure you attend so you don't miss out on this fun event. See you there! If you have a sibling at YLMS or want to be a part of Baby Bobcats, bring your sibling and yourself to room 65 at break today if you want to be featured on BCTV. Attention all Bobcats, spirit wear kickoff is on Friday. Make sure to wear your spirit wear. Sixth graders, the annual sixth grade homework club is today from 3.35 to 4.30 in room 17. Also, next week, Wednesday will be a Web Wednesday day. This Friday is the halfway mark. Progress reports will be submitted by your teachers. Progress reports are not report cards, but they give you an idea of what your grades are. They will be mailed home. Also, the same Friday, there will be an assembly, so that means there will be a special schedule. If you are in band or color guard, there will be pastries in the parking lot for you guys to enjoy. Also, next week, we will have a special Proud Paw drawing. We hope you can keep collecting. Mr. Watts will stop by next week to do that drawing. Hey, Faith, where do I turn in my Proud Paw? You turn your Proud Paws into the student store with your name and the signature of the staff that gave it to you with the outstanding act marked on the Proud Pod to get your special treat. Besides Proud Pods, you can get by so many other items in the student store. Here's a video on the student store. Take a look. I'm Ashley. And I'm Emily. And we're, we're the Bobcats. Bob <laughs> Hello, welcome to the student store. What would you guys like to buy? Mentos. I want some Black Forest gummy bears and Mentos. Walker Divider. Here's the events code. Keep it. 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 And now here's Cam and Mr. Castro with an announcement. Hi, good morning Bobcats. I'm here to announce how we did on our school fundraiser. Originally, our goal was to get $20,000 in sales, 
but we ended up doing over $33,000 in our sales. So to congratulate the school on this, we are going to pick five teachers to get pie faced. So those five teachers are... Don't pick me. I hope it's Nyren. Mr. Castro. <laughs> Did you rig it? No. Miss Castaneda. Woo! Miss Smith. Is that all language arts teacher? Miss Johnson. And finally, drum roll. Miss Taylor. So congratulations to all these teachers. You're going to get pie faced, but also the top five selling students in the whole school are going to pie face these teachers. So those students are Mar Mariah Padilla, Kate Wadle, Jack Cazada, Ava Siniskowski, and Hannah Vernola. Please see Mr. Castro today at break and he will talk to you about that. Good job, Bob Cass, and keep the good work. All right, now, announcements myself. Um, as you guys can see, I want to talk to you guys about the fundraiser prizes and bonus prizes. If you sold one item, you get to choose from a splat emoji or chicken donation. Many of you guys already received it, but if you have not received yours, please see us at break or after school in my room. If you sold four items, you will get to attend the Ex Pogo event on November 8th. You will receive a ticket for that event later. If you sold seven items, you will get to attend the Money Scramble on November 9th, and we will give you another ticket at a later date. If you sold 11 items, you will get to attend the Drop Zone Water Park. We will be going to this park later in the year, so tickets will come when we get closer. If you sold 15 items, you will get to attend the Castle Park Field Trip on December 2nd. We will also give you the tickets at a later date. And if you sold 20 items, you get to attend the Triple Wheel Spin next week on Thursday, October 6th at lunch. You will receive a price ticket from your first period teacher. For all the bonus prizes, these prizes are only for students who have collected a certain amount of prizes. On the first day, if you sold three items, you got to choose the Color Morph sunglasses. And if you sold 10 items, you should have received the VR goggles. From your first period teacher, you received those price tickets. For day two, of the turn-in. If you sold an additional three prizes, these students get to earn a wallet that looks like a hundred dollar bill. Inside three of those wallets was a fake twenty dollar bill. Guess what? Many of you haven't redeemed them and none of you have received the twenty dollar bill. So please stop by today at break with your pink prize ticket to see if you win that twenty dollars. And now lastly, on our last turn-in day there was one more bonus prize. Cash bingo and ice cream bars at lunch. We haven't given you the prize tickets yet. You will receive those prize tickets next week. This will take place on Tuesday, October 4th at lunch. You will have your prize tickets. You must have your prize ticket to attend. ASB will mark a special area for us to have this fun event. Please let me know if you have any questions. Thank you guys so much for your support in the fundraiser. Thank you, Cam and Mr. Castro. It's that time again. Now we want to thank you for watching another live episode of BCTV 2.0. Well, I'm Faith. And I'm Jaylene. Here is your inspirational quote of the day. If opportunity doesn't knock, build the door. So keep building those doors, Bobcats. Remember, Bobcats, make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. <laughs>